Let's go over the Ryobi Compact Table Saw. The model number for this is RTS08. I do not know if this is a new model or not, but I seriously saw this and I had to get it. This was $119, which I was actually looking for a new table saw because the table saw that I have, I bought like about 11 years ago. And I put it through the, I put it through its works and you know I wanted to upgrade to something a little bit newer for the table saw. And like I say in every circular saw, table saw, or miter saw video, I get a different blade for it than what it, whatever it comes with, and that goes for all brands. The traditional blade that you get from other brands is like 24 teeth. That that's that's standard. It's a much cleaner and more smoother cut. So I got the 60 tooth blade for this table saw. And so yeah, so let's go over this really quick, uh, test this out and see how this actually is. And I'm actually excited about this. And this seriously majorly looks better than the model that I have and it's, it is more compact. So this is an eight and a quarter inch compact table saw. It has, it's 13 amps, steel frame mounts for added durability and strength, integrated dust chute, which I like that, rack and pinion blade height adjustment for accurate depth control, tool free guarding, table mount push stick storage, and integrated onboard storage for all accessories. All right, so let's unbox the accessories and see what we got. And remember, for when it comes to saws, read the manual. Yeah, I'm outside this time because this is a, it's a big tool. Got anti-kickback. That's nice, I like that. Nice secure lock. And of course it comes uh, wrenches tools to change your blade out it has the the push stick that goes right there uh, I like that that that's there that's that's nifty that's handy all right but first thing we're gonna do is we are gonna change out that blade all right so how this goes on that the nut goes on the back then there we go I will need a flathead just like that, put the end cap on. Done. So since that's done, let's uh, change out the, I want to change the blade out. I love this, all I gotta do is twist that, and then pull up, you're good to go. See, it is brand new. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. I'll take out the Wait, I see. Alrighty, so let's put that back on. There we go, new blade is on. Put this back on. Lock it. I love that. Hey, you don't need these that much, just once in a while. Just tighten that down. Land it going anywhere. All right, so next, let's put this these in. These are for the, the push stick. That goes in like that. Yeah, I like that. Nice and clamped down. Probably just too low. And there we go. Not too shabby if you ask me. 
It says model number RTS08, 13 amps, 5700 RPM, 8 and a quarter inch or 210 millimeter blades. So yeah, it's a nice little, it's a nice little saw. Like I said, I do love the new design and how it looks. I do love how the on and off switch is. If you push it, it stops very, very quickly and it doesn't just wind down, it actually stops. And it's actually not that loud. I like that. And I'm wondering if it comes with a lock. You might have to get your own uh, like padlock for that. And so yeah, it's a nice little saw. All right, but let's actually take this off and put it in its storage. And it does have the rip fence holder right here. Get it a little bit closer. There we go. Has a rip fence holder, I like that. Like I said, it's compact because I guess they made it compact just by having everything storage like that. I might be wrong, that's not, that might not how it goes on, but, but there we go. See how easy that is to take off. There we go. Let's see how this works. Let's just do an inch. An inch, let's measure the accuracy of this cut. Oh, I like that saw. All right, so let's see the accuracy on that. Yep, and that is minus the blade. That is minus the blade. All right, but very good. I, I love this saw. Let's uh, finish cutting this up. that I like this saw Bam. My first impression is that this thing is awesome. For $119, this is not a bad saw at all. Like I said, I love this switch. I love that you could also have it locked. As you can see, there's holes there where you can have a lock there. It, it seriously is a good saw, like for $119, this saw is perfect. The older saw is more expensive than this one. I think I paid 160 11 years ago for the other saw and th this saw is fantastic. It really is. If you're in need for an inexpensive saw and to take over this Black Friday sale, this thing is awesome. It does the trick. As you can see, it changed the blade. It does very fine cuts, you know, and it's, uh, and so yeah, this saw is worth it. I'm so glad I, I saw this and I got it, uh, so yeah. Yeah, the model for this is RTS08. 
I saw, you, you guys saw on how this is assembled and how it works. Uh, get a 60 or 40 tooth blade to make, the, make these fine, clean cuts. And so, yeah, so that's pretty much it, guys. I hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave and Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.